Valley Space, we are always working to make the lives of engineers easy. With the new integrated catalog, engineers will be able to import off-the-shelf satellite models, subsystems and components into their own design. This will significantly decrease the amount of time spent on trivial tasks, valuable time which engineers can spend on performing their actual jobs, which is making advanced models and calculations. This is how Valley Space empowers engineers. In this tutorial, we will learn how to use the satellite catalog. To get to the catalog, we go to catalog.valleyspace.com. Then, to log in, use the username catalog and the password valleyspace. After logging in, we find ourselves in the satellite catalog. It consists of three parts, the constants, orbital parameters and the satellite. In the constants section, all types of constants can be found, ranging from general and planet-specific constants to material and propellant properties. In the orbital parameter section, a set of orbital parameters for Earth-bound satellites is present. Lastly, in the satellite section, the actual satellite components can be found. The components are ordered according to the subsystem they belong to. Reaction wheels, for instance, can be found in the AOCS section. Let's say we want to export an onboard computer. To do this, we navigate to the Command and Data Handling section, right-click the onboard computer we want and click Export JSON. This will download a zip file containing the JSON package for the component. We do the same for the orbital parameter section. Now, to import this into our own project, we navigate to our satellite project. Here, we right-click the satellite component and click Import JSON. We locate the zip file on our local machine and drag and drop the orbital parameters into the dialog box. The orbital parameters comprises of some input parameters, which can be fully defined in the corresponding outputs, which are dependent on these inputs. The velocity graph is one of the outputs, which shows the velocity of the satellite over its orbit. To better understand the graph, we change the range to 0 to 10 radians. To show the dynamic part of the orbital parameters, we change the semi-major axis. All influenced outputs will automatically change. Now, we right-click the data handling component and import the onboard computer. All values in the different components are standardized. This can be, for instance, useful in calculating the sum of children. All components contain a link to where the information is originally from. We can find this link in the Information tab on the right. To get additional information about the product, simply follow the link. Here, we find ourselves on the SetSearch website where we can find even more information and additionally can get in touch with the supplier. As you have seen, we are able to import components in a matter of minutes. Make sure to try it out yourself and explore the full capabilities of Alispace. Thank you for watching and I wish you a joyful engineering time.